what is the difference distinction between statement of affairs versus balance sheet <clears throat> reliability statement of affairs is actually prepared under the single entry system so that you might have estimates of figures estimates of your assets but balance sheet is under the double entry system and is far more reliable so this is reliable this is not really reliable capital under a statement of affairs the capital is the balancing figure balancing figure but in a balance sheet it comes from all the accounts we prepare capital account is also an account that we prepare there is no balancing figure as such in the balance sheet when we bring forward all the balances of assets and liabilities the balance sheet will tally omission there is a greater chance of errors and omission in case of single entry and therefore in the statement of affairs but in a in case of a double entry being followed the chances are very little <coughs> far less <coughs> what is the basis of valuation under statement of affairs nothing is really disclosed but when we follow the double entry system we know we we disclose also the method of valuation of inventories method of valuation of investments etc what is the objective <clears throat> objective in preparing a statement of affairs is to arrive at the balance of capital but in case of a balance sheet the objective is to ascertain the financial position we have all the balances there is no balancing figure in a balance sheet it consists of all the balances of assets and liabilities derived from the ledger accounts and helps to ascertain the financial position so balance sheet helps to give us the financial position a statement of affairs is often prepared to find out what is the capital as on that date <clears throat>